Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Hello, come here. Oh, da, 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 da. Right. Sit for me. Good girl, where's oh, that Oh, shit, best girl. Oh, shit. Good girl. Are you looking at me now? Where's your treat? Hey, come here, I'll give you a treat. I'll give you a little... Oh, da, 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 da. Yo, Harry, where's our engines? <laughs> What are you doing? Is something wrong with your feet now? Is there a happy, um, like happy feet? I don't know. Man's was 12 or 13 years of age. I didn't have a license. I was the only place I could practice travel lights. In the warehouse! In the warehouse! Shit, you're early. What are you doing? Yo! What? They're early. we got to start the video. What's happening? Tell you exactly what's happening. Here we are, another day in the life, AJ Retros and other things. Bush. So here we are, AJ Retros, Alex, you know him. Flash him up on screen now, isn't it? What are you doing? Something wrong with your feet now? Is there happy, um, like happy feet, I know. I'm wondering how far that would go down if I fell through. Shall we find out? No, we're no. all good. So yeah. Shout out Sapphire Valadin when we're here as well. Our boy Chris is local as well. Link on the screen. Other things of interest, it's like an 80s car factory at the minute. We got a 1.6205 GDI. We've got a 1965 Beetle that wasn't registered until 67. There's a separate video on that. We got a Volvo 480, which has nothing to do with hell on earth. That's right, hell on earth. Don't worry about it, we'll come to that another time. And my favorite is we've got this over here with a color coded wooden rear quarter mod. So I forgot this thing's getting. Not doing too bad, is it? No motor. No motor. Well done. Well done. I should have think in my head what's it go like. Yo, Harry, where's our engines? I gotta put up with it. Yo, where's our engines? In the warehouse! In the warehouse! That's the theory I seen it. Fucking guy Jen, isn't it? <laughs> so we've been down here filming some Beatle videos today. Damn straight. This one and another one. And um it's been good, done it. Another one. <laughs> This yeah. wasn't in here last time. It's lovely, 1965 this one is. I love the white and the blue. And that white especially, I got a lot of time for that. He's brought his beetle inside because he thought he needed something he didn't actually need. Good in it, though, isn't it? It's the first time it's been in here. And it don't need, and it don't need to be in here. Love it. Outside as well, uh, yeah. there's a few more beetles going on, including the one we filmed earlier. But separate video of that coming. What else are we over there? We got an RS6, RS6 Polo Coupe. Which is quite cool. GL, what was it G or GL Coupe? It's a coupe of some sort. Right, tell you what, this red bug though, I'm fine. Ah. It's nice, isn't it? Nice bit of airbrushing in it as well, which is quite cool. On the Ronald Aeros as well, which is quite nice. I do like those wheels. Not, that's not a bad work car park, is it? That's nice, I love that. But look at the height on this. This is the other Bundy bug, the other murder mobile. Look at the height on it. That's awesome, isn't it? 1972. I've made him carry all my stuff now. 1972. I've got to carry that because it don't fit on my back, even with the big straps. Yeah, it looks like it's carrying a child's bag, doesn't it? <laughs> Here we go, as we were saying. AJ Retro is where we are. We're gonna book it now and we're gonna go and get some food. Damn straight. <laughs> Tell you what, there's some cool stuff around here, isn't it? Come a on, new man. Q3 Sport, right? You got a new Porsche, which is basically a Q5. That's not even right. mentioned in the Mark Supra. Dude! Is that a Supra? It was until you put your hand in front of it. <laughs> Everything you do, you put your hand in front of it. Nice, that is, mate. That's awesome, isn't it? I'll shout for a little bit as well. You've got something to say, yeah? God, it's cold in here. I'm not even joking. The windows don't shut properly. Hang on. This is what amazes me with people, though. They'll pull out one new and stuff. They think, oh, it's a beetle in slow. I'm just taking it along, man. 60 miles an hour. Just idling at 60. It's no problem at all. Like, I've driven this car in Mexico, but my speed on stops at 90, and the needle was down a bit further. So. I've seen it. I was there. Um, I was there with the sangria and fucking. 
Out of the box, somebody who rolls on. And I saw it. True story though. So true story. Think, it's not a slow car whatsoever. No. Yeah, I know it's a bit low, but it's, it's practical. Um, a couple of weeks ago when we were doing a bit of uh, day in the life stuff, this Beetle had a bit of a... Uh, Oh, a bit of an interesting noise coming from the front. Not that squeaking, that's, that's the tire in the wheel arch. Yeah, that's, that's normal. normal. We that's expect normal. that. Yeah, there's a bit of a uh, bit of a weird rub coming from the front. Now what it was, I think, is because the gyms have been shut for a while, I probably put on a bit of timber. But as of two weeks ago, I got my new glasses in it. They're carbon fibre. We're weight saving. Therefore, weight saving. I fixed new car with carbon fibres on. <laughs> I know who you said. True story. Oh no, where we are it though. Obviously, at the moment, we are literally like a little bit of our former self. Obviously, normally, we gym every day, five miles. You know, beard's always trimmed, this nice at the barbers. I haven't had a beard trim since before Christmas, since obviously lockdown started. I'm protesting is what I'm doing, so that's what's happening. This is our boy Grant coming down there. There he is, happening, Grant. What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Although, I'm not even biased, I'm not biased, it's all nice and it's all shiny. Come on, check out that man, that's what's going on. Don't forget as well, scroll back a few videos, a full review of this is on the YouTube channel. It is. I don't know why you specified the YouTube channel, because this is on the YouTube channel. On our Viking Views channel, link in the description. Push. It's not a link in the description, we are the Viking Views channel. No, to buy it. To buy it. It's there. Jesus, it's all going on. The AI beard, you've given up smoking. Yes, I have. We Yes! There we go. Stop. See my mum and dad last week, well, was it, on the weekend, wasn't it? And they you said to you giving up, so that's good. It is good. So that was our boy Grant. You remember him from the A1 and the BMW yeah, videos. Go and give some love to Grant. In the first, link on the screen. In the first two weeks, I think he had his car, he got about 700 miles on it, 600 of which were in Portugal City Front. True story. True, he's only left, yeah, what's he done? Seven something thousand miles there. And he's only left four three or four times. Parkles and stuff. He's got parkles, we haven't got a car for parkles. Fuck how much we don't You know what, I'd love to live on this street though. Oh, I wouldn't, not with all these fucking parkles. Yeah. Jesus. Couldn't get the camera on quick enough, but shout out to our little boy and our little red fiesta. Say something though, I was in the right lane doing 70 mile an hour in the 70 and still thought he'd have a go, so he feels good on undertaking a beat up. Brick! Congratulations, you undertook a fucking car from 1965. Brick! Oh, I might be able to get him now, hold on. Turn him right gears now, he lives in Broadlands. <laughs> See, the good thing about these is, if you put the rear <laughs> window washer on, it cleans the entire back of the car. Useful that, isn't it? It's happening. Good thinking, Henry Ford. McDonald's drive through Just wanted to say, nice MX-5. Got time for an MX-5. Even newer ones. I like them. What are you saying about MX-5s? Yeah, man, I'd love to get my hands on one and have a little go, can I? Get some sideways action on a tin. Um, have to be a convertible, that's obviously not a top one, aren't it? No, that's, that is a convertible. That is, yeah. That's a folding hard top, isn't it? Yeah, there we go. Let's go back to it. One of them ones, so I fit in it. Yeah, well, it's got the roof that comes off, so he'd be able to fit him big self in there. What's happening? Grand Big Mac with bacon. Good afternoon, what are we doing? Can I have a large ground Big Mac meal with bacon, please? With what, drink? Uh, can I have a Diet Coke, no ice? Yep. Um, can I have a triple cheeseburger on his own? Yep. Can I have a box of six chicken nuggets? Any sauce? Uh, barbecue and sweet and sour, please. Yep. Can I also then have a box of 20 chicken nuggets, please? What sauce? Uh, lots of barbecue. Yep. Can I have a large fries? Yep. A large strawberry milkshake? Yep. Uh, and a millionaire's donut, please. Right. Anything else? Oh, yeah, can I have a plain hamburger as well, please? Anything else? And that's everything, thank you. Any sauce, then? Uh, sweet and sour and barbecue, please. There you go. Get that all the scratch on the screen. Dry down them things. Nice one, thank you. Thank you. Yo, it's a year ago. I gotta turn this heat down. I'm fucking cold, dying. Yeah. You? I'm cold. No, I haven't turned the heat down because I'm cold. <laughs> true, true. Yeah, fair. True story. Um, Monday today, obviously, missed getting filmed. Don't know when it's gonna drop, but on the weekend, just moved in with my partner, and I wore shorts all weekend, moving stuff, and I've caught a chill. And it's two days after, and I still can't get warm, especially after being around that beetle today. 
man's cold. Oh yeah, if you spend any time in the Beetle, you're going to be very cold. I don't know if anybody's lived in his Beetle, but yeah. I am a bit, like. bit on the chill side, like, but... I'm a bit on the chill side, but different. I'm straight. Yo, it's a year ago tomorrow. Might be Wednesday, give or take. And just show him, because I mentioned it earlier, my carbon oh, fiber elasticity back. and weight saving. Yeah, but anyway, it's a year ago tomorrow or Wednesday that I had my Q7. No. <laughs> How long do you have it? Six months, seven months? I had it in March, got rid of it a couple of days for my birthday in September. Six months? Jesus Christ almighty, isn't it? Like, it's because of you that Ron Skinner exists. Tell you what, right? It would have been easier. And the car supermarkets are available. It would have been easier, right, for me to keep my S4, put 10 grand aside, in, in a big like cardboard box, and just set fire to it. And the boxes are available. Because that's what I did, lost 10 grand for nothing but I've got an S5 that makes me very very happy you were driving around in a two bedroom detached house for six months though yeah but did that's it bring me joy no I made a lot of memories of Meg in that car which was cool I see the geezer at his boy and girl in the car behind I'm guessing boyfriend and girlfriend they look the sort the boy is there <laughs> they look the sort the boy is there with his mask on in a car yeah with his missus but he is driving a blue motion polo so that would explain a lot Different subject completely. I love the colour of that fiesta. Shabby chic. That's like not too ghost, not that guy blue, but somewhere in between. That's like a chalk paint, I love it. You can probably hear the incessant honk in a Makata, which may or may not be under attack, but nobody gives a shit. Tell me now. We did a McDonald's order. You ordered an extra little something. Tell me about your extra little something. People want to know. Fuck me. I. <laughs> oh, yeah. So we done a McDonald's order now. I needed an extra something. Tell them. Man like this order. Obviously, anywhere I go, if I'm gonna get a little happy. You know, sometimes I get a happy meal for it. For my dog Rags, this is. You know, I either. Have a hot meal, should have the, the burger out of there. I'll have the fries in it. Share the toy. Share the fucking toy. But today, plain hamburger. She won't eat the bread, but I'll take the burger out, rip it apart, put it up in her in her food. Sometimes she's getting old, isn't she? She don't you know we've changed it to older food now as well. Mm. But I don't wanna put on soft food yeah. I wanna keep it on on that sort of food. So having a bit of a treat like that helps her eat the food a little bit more. She's if we've right. got it, cut two rags eating the burger. Look at her licking her lips now. You know what's coming, don't you? You Mackie D's is coming. Well, Daddy's just chopping in, then you can have it. It's not happy, Milos. You can't share a toy. <laughs> it's alright. They haven't been having so much fun recently because they've been giving top trumps. Oh, Jesus. You know, we can't play with top trumps together. No, can I have a burger now? Can you not play with top trumps together because you don't understand the rules? Standard. Oh, are you looking forward to this? Oh, look at you doing your little sneezes. I'm going to have a bit of a teaser first then. Go on, do it again. Oh, good girl. Oh, what am I asking for? Good girl. Chew it gently then. Here we are, look, a McDog. Bit your nose now, look. Go on. Good girl. Oh, best girl in the world you are, innit? And in your food rags. Hey, no, no. There's some in there, Lars, in there. There's some in there. Go on, you'll find it. You're beautiful. We have finished the food. We are now a couple of seconds away from Rest Bay in Porth Call. Where Grant, yes, him from earlier on, <laughs> has done approximately six out of the 7,000 miles in his car in fucking Rest Bay. So, yes, we're going to go around the corner now. How long from this point until we see Grant? Because I bet he'll be cruising up and down this road somewhere. <laughs> and we're going to keep this on and we're going to find out. Tell you what, though, it's a beautiful part of the world to live in. You are very blessed to have it right on my doorstep. Mix it up a little bit, prove to myself I can do it. Just like when you used to play Getaway back in the day or Grand Theft Auto and stop at traffic lights, you know? I do stop at traffic lights in the real world, just saying, but 
No. I can't stop a traffic lights in Grand Theft Auto and get away. That's bad nah, as shit. No, but if you want to mix it up, because you're fed up of fooling around the place. Just wanted to have chill and be a normal citizen. I wanted to have chill. <laughs> Man's was 12 or 13 years of age. I didn't have a license. I was the only place I could practice traffic lights. Getting <laughs> something wrong with you. You've been probably 13 years old practicing traffic lights on Grand Theft Auto. Restaurants were out there beating holes to death and he's practicing traffic lights. At 12 or 13 years of age, mind. As a younger. Yo, here's Grant, I can see him. No. I'm not even joking. He's choking. Grant. Ah! <laughs> That's fucking amazing. Not even joking. Didn't plan it. I'm serious to fuck. I've not planned this. <laughs> there he is. Told him he's always fucking down, yeah? That's fucking awesome! Here we are, I should be popping up to the right now. Man's constantly on the cruise. There he is! Watch him get away from Fucking hell! <laughs> so, I don't know exactly how long I was. I will put a counter on the screen for the video, but. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, 7,000 miles on the car, 6,000 of which he's driving on his fucking road. True story, every time I take the Beetle out, all this out or whatever, man's there. There he is, you can film him now when he pulls up. So, we rounded the corner, and I said, how long until we see Grant? And there you are. Well, I was doing my drone photography like. Ah, well done. Aye. Drone photography was doing if you didn't get that. Nice. Yeah. Nice bit of the world to do drone photography, isn't it? Yeah, that damn straight, lovely part of the world. Yeah. Have a nose down the front, does it? Let's get it done, innit? Go on. <laughs> now, this, the reason he's laughing, the reason he's laughing is he knows. What he's packing. Look at that damn thing. Say hello to my little friend. Sat Just man. excited to see us now, isn't it? 600 mil lens. Jesus Christ. Fair play, Grant boy. It's all going on. He's got yeah. one mil of lens for every mile of respite he drove in the first <laughs> fortnight he had the car. Right. Yeah, true story. So going back to that prick in the little fiesta earlier. Sorry, they just rubbed me up the wrong way. Whenever I'm in the Beetle, someone wants to try it on, someone wants to have a play, whether that's ride your ass, overtake you, pull out on you. Whenever I'm in the transporter, someone again always wants to have a play, someone wants to pull out on you, just be a bit of a dick. So the one, whenever I'm in the S5, never happens. Never, never, ever happens. You know, you see something, no one pulls out on you, no one wants to race you, no one wants to be a dick behind you. It's never the right car at the right time. True story. True story. But yeah man, thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already, drop us a sub, drop us a like, give us a share. Buy a t-shirt. Buy a t-shirt. Link in the description. Um, and such. <laughs> if there's somebody you know that you think they would enjoy these boys, share our video to them, yeah. share our channel to them. If every single one of our subscribers did that, we would double in size overnight. True story. Thank fuck. I got the carbon fibre glasses to keep the weight down, innit? <laughs> but on our bombshell, until next time, thank you very much for watching.